Okay, this is going to be a video on how to use the gallery. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do is start from the dashboard. Okay, now if you want to create a gallery, you come down here on the left hand side where it says gallery and you're going to click on add gallery and images. Okay, and the first thing you're going to do is to create a gallery. You can also create um, albums, but we're going to create a gallery, and we're going to name it, okay, My Third Gallery. Okay, and then we're going to add files. All right, and so I just have a bunch of pictures here. I'm going to add them in, okay. And then as soon as I see them here, I'm going to click Start Upload. And down here is um, an area that will indicate that they're uploading. And as they upload, you'll see the little green check over here. And then you'll get a message, Upload Complete. So they're all uploaded and they're all named into that one gallery. So now let's go create a post. Okay, we're going to add new. All right, now let's pretend we're going to add a post about um, my third gallery. And then you'll have, uh, you know, uh, some ideas about what you're going to write. But the first thing you want to do is add the gallery to this page. So you're going to go up here to this little green square, and it's going to say attach next gen gallery to the post so you click on that and it's going to open up this dialog box and you can fiddle around with all these different choices here but i'm going to use this basic one that it defaults to um, the basic thumbnails okay and then it's going to ask you what would you like to display and you want to display a gallery and you want to display my third gallery okay and you could create a slug, which is just a short form. So you can skip that if you want. And then this is, uh, you're going to click on Customize the Display Settings. Okay, and so I have this on 12 images per page. That's pretty good. And then the number of columns, let's say it can uh, display up to four columns. Okay, and these I'm going to put on, um, actually I'm just going to let them be um, the way that they default. Okay, and down here for template, I'm going to click on Gallery Carousel. That's going to be the template. And here you would click this if you wanted to um, switch the arrangement. Like say you wanted this one to be the second one. You could just arrange the pictures here, and then you would click Refresh, okay, and then Save. Okay, and that's going to save this as an album. And I'm going to come over here. You would do your SEO down below, but over here I'm going to click Publish. Okay, and then we're going to view the post. Okay, and there's going to be the album. Let me see if I can shrink this down here so we can see it. Okay, and then the person who's viewing your website can click from one picture to the next. Okay. Alrighty, and this one uses the, um, the caption, so you might want to make sure that you put your captions in. Okay. So let's go back to the dashboard and we're going to go to the gallery, manage galleries, okay, and let's say we just created the third gallery, so let's go in here, okay, and down here is where you can change your, your title, you know, long layered hair style whatever and then you would put your description in this box okay try to use your keywords same thing here keywords 
description fill all this in and then your tags you're just going to um, put your keywords together with uh, the commas and you just uh, use as many as are relevant to whichever picture you're focused on okay once you make all of those changes you can click save changes and now if you decide you want to resort your gallery you can come and click on sort gallery and then you can you know drag and drop and decide who's first who's last whatever and then update sort order okay and uh, it's the same thing let's go back here all posts okay um, let's see my third gallery so let's go let's go in here and we'll um, we'll do another choice here so let's take this out here and delete it okay and go back to the visual and we'll go and click on the green square all right and let's see now we'll try this uh, next gen compact album okay what would you like to display we're still going to uh, do gallery because we haven't created any albums and maybe we'll try the uh, third gallery here customize display settings let's put this on no use this all no here except for the last one that says yes um, show slideshow link okay and then we're going to choose um, well, this time we'll choose gallery PHP that'll be the template then we already sorted them so we'll click save okay and we'll click update all right and now we'll view the post okay and this will throw it up in a slightly different fashion so you can click on them one at a time okay they want to see them okay or you can click on show slideshow and then they just fade from one picture to the other as you click on them so you can fiddle around and decide which um, which format you want to use for each of your galleries but that's pretty much how your galleries work